Hello again. It's Jamie McCall, and I'm here to say, piss on enlightenment. That's right, I said it. Enlightenment can suck it. <laughs> it's like, it's like, burn some sage, tap on your face, poke your armpit, tai chi, qi gong, fireballs, energy clearings, affirmations, and lifting, and psychology, and readings, and ebooks, and talk to your angels, and and pray, and sit with a shaman, and om, and harmonics, and solfeggio, and binaural beats, and I mean, it's like seeking, and seeking, and seeking, and reading, and reading. Since 2006, I've been on this, like, maniacal journey, and I've tried every modality out there, and you know what? I'm over it. <laughs> I'm, I've just decided I'm over it. I'm over it. I mean, I love learning and I love the seeking and all of that, but I'm ready to just be. I have enough information. Um, I think we all have enough information at this point to just, instead of start, instead of like going, 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 trying to do, trying to make, trying to heal, trying to fix, we just need to just relax and try to be more of what we already are. We already know what we need to know. You know what I mean? It's like now it's just time to be it and live it. And so that's where I'm at now. And I know a lot of people are in the same position. I mean, I've heard, like, Panash Desai talk about that, um, about, you know, you don't need fixing, you don't need healing. And I get it, you know. I, I get, I, I'm at that stage as well, where I just want to start being, applying, allowing, instead of all of this, you know, trying to figure it out and trying to make it better and trying to fix it and trying to do it. It's already there. It's, it's all already there, you know. We're already enlightened. I'm already enlightened. You're already enlightened. You just have to allow it. It's not going to be some big, with fireworks, I mean, for most of us. For the very rare few, it is like this big instant, you know, shift and click. But for the majority of us, it's a process and it's a journey, just like everything else. And it comes in stages. If you just allow it, it'll come gradually and naturally, in its own way, in its own time. and just have to allow that to happen and just watch and be aware and, and and see it happening within you and so that's where I'm at now and I just wanted to share that with you I hope I didn't shock a lot of you with the with the title of my video and um, or offend anybody I mean I'm all for the seeking and the journey and all that I'm just letting you know that I'm at the stage where I'm over it I'm over it. I have enough information. I have all the tools. I've tried every modality. Some seem to work, at least temporarily. Some don't. But I just feel like at this point, you know, I am my own guru. I want to be my own guru. I'm my own savior, as are you. So, um, you know, just, if we could just stop the constant seeking and, and healing and fixing and trying to make reparations and reliving the past, you know, that's gone. We're here now. This is the new age. It's actually the now age, you know. I've heard some people say there is no new age. The only age is now. <laughs> and we're living it. So let's just live it. So just had to share that with you. Piss off enlightenment. That's what I say. So not, this, not that I'm saying I'm not going to read any more books or stop the learning, I, because I enjoy it. Not because, not in desperation, because I feel like I have to, you know what I mean? But because I enjoy learning and expanding and growing and seeing how other people handle things. Um, but it's just going to be, you know, in a more relaxed state because I want to, because I enjoy it, not because I feel like it's going to be some kind of saving grace. I already have the saving grace. And so do you. So you can do that too. But you can start by reading my book first, Living the High Life Without Drinking the Champagne. It was just published in February, and uh, I'm really proud of it. And it's a lot about, you know, what I'm talking about here, plus my time in the Navy, and then my time in Hollywood, and my evolution, and my shift, and how that manifested for me, and is still manifesting to this very video where I say, Suck it, enlightenment. <laughs> All right, take care. Until next time. Bye-bye.